this. I can eat habaneros plain, but wasabi is a different chemical, so it's it still gets me. So I appreciate that. He's getting to me right now, so I'll take that. Uh, so this is my collection that I probably shouldn't show off to you two, but uh, here we go. You want to do some GX? Yeah, let's play that some. I'm, I've right. seen like speedruns of that game. It looks super cool. Yeah. There's like, what is the thing where you ride the side of the shift boosting? Yeah, that's so cool. Where you can go off the stage and once there's no ground under you, there's no upper bound on your speed. Uh -huh. You have to get back on stage in time. That's crazy. Yeah. All right. Versus battle. Yeah, oh, we still have more controllers in. Uh, I don't care. Ruby Cup. We can do whatever stage. Will I be able to control as player three? Uh, yes. You think so? Oh, I see what you said. What can I use? Uh, yeah. Sorry. Oh. Oh. Common sense. Alright, so how, what are the controls? Also, uh, the card customizable. Check customizable. So let's go into options. Oh, here. I just want to do standard. You just want to do standard? Yeah. Okay. This will. Oh, okay. So this is on mine, which actually may not be what yours is doing. So obviously steer. So you actually use L and R to shift, to slide, uh, to strafe your character one way or another. You, if you're in the air, if you hit a ramp, you can use the C stick up and down to like, nose dive or to keep yourself floating. Side attack. What are those? Uh, you're going to like nudge yourself such that if there's a car to your side, you'll hit them and drain them of some health. Your boost in, in F-Zero games is also your health gauge, and when your health hits zero, you're done. There's also a spin attack, which is, yeah, less risky, but... And it also actually sometimes comes up in attacking this game, where you can use it to cover turns a bit better. Um, okay, what is, uh, what is boost? Y button. Yeah, but like, what does that do? Makes you go faster? Or? It makes you go faster for about two seconds, and... Uh, your boost gauge is also your health. So when your health is low, you can't boost much. Um, Does it regenerate? No. Well, there are pads on the on the game oh. on the map you have to run over uh, to regenerate that. And there'll be usually one or two of them per map per lap. Uh, okay. On your first stage, though, your first lap, you don't get any boost unlocked. It basically gives you a chance to learn the track, and then boost gets unlocked. Um, yeah, and you, of course you break with the. Ta da! Alrighty. Alright. And actually, it probably is instructive for you to hit this instead. Um, if you'll hit enter, uh, press it now. Just to make sure. Okay, so it is the same. Because I may have customized it because of my grip. I mentioned that. Oh, do you use Claw for everything? I use Claw for everything now. I even play non game games with Claw. Um, unless it's on a PlayStation controller, which is not reverse access, then it's it's not really much of a, an issue. But if it is, well, there we go. So versus battle, two players. I go to Aeropolis because it's my favorite accessible stage, but we can just do whatever. Oh, let's go to Aeropolis. Okay. Alright, so which, which car should we? So... Blue Falcon? The best for, like, speedrunning is usually... Either Black Bull, which is my favorite, it's the Bowser of this game, um, or where is Fat Shark? Fat Shark. These are both cars that naturally have a fast speed, and Fat Shark's boost is, by a substantial margin, the fastest in the game. So much so that they made a version of GX. It's a mod, like when it takes for Melee, where all the other cars get caught up to Fat Shark. That's, that's kind of broken. But Fat Shark is a little bit tricky to wield because he turns slowly, so until you learn all the drift shenanigans, it gets a little tough. So like, my speed is all the way up on this. Wait, how, you can adjust the speed? Yep. Your speed and acceleration is balanced between the two. So this is low speed, high acceleration. And if you turn the acceleration all the way down, there is a snaking in this game. Where it's exactly what it sounds like. You'll turn left and shift right, turn right, shift left, and do that back and forth. And you get a stupid amount of speed. Alright. Is that too low? That's fine. I... That's where to start anyway. I would contend. The physics in this game are silly. This was a... 
the company, the group that made it, they called it the Triforce. It was Nintendo, Sega, and I think Capcom or Namco. It's one of those. But Nintendo and Sega cooperated on this. It was kind of their first poem on GX. Oh, oh god! I should be player one. Oh, hello! Yes. I just wow. Okay. Hello. There we go. Hey. Alright. Similar to Double Dash, you'll hold your L and R to drift. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is hard to see what I'm doing. Yeah, unfortunately the split screen is a little hard to do. I wish that they had done Oh no, that was an option for us! We could have changed the uh, the split screen to be horizontal rather than vertical. So that was my bad. But I haven't done that too much on here, so my B. Too soon, Jay. Way too soon. Oh, and there are mines on this one. And there's ice as well. Because ice makes sense when you're playing with a hovercraft. I'm glad there's rails, that's all I'm thinking. Oh, yeah. No kidding. Yeah, it gets kind of silly in story mode. Hey. I'm getting the hang of it. Oh, okay. I actually got. I actually first just used food. I mean, uh, okay. the whatever it's called, drift. One thing I... they thought of being competitive so much in this game, because it's also an arcade, I suppose, that if you hit a boost pad on exactly the side of it, then you'll actually get a little bit more of a boost. You get a greater percent boost if you hit the boost pad just to the side. And I learned about that from watching a speedrun of it. Similar... Oh, what's up? A little bit of speedrun this that maybe you can get. That's the one. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. I'm super. Oh, I hit my head. I bonked my head on the ceiling, on the bridge there. That's that's cute. I've never done that before. I guess I was going a bit too quickly. I guess. Well, these turn first. Yeah. There we go. There's a video on my channel of me doing one of the stages where uh, it was featured in CGN speedrun at GDQ. On the GDQs. Oh no! Oh no! I may have left you. Nah. No, no. You're good. I can actually see you. I'm not up. Whoa. Yeah, in that case... Oh, uh, hey, that wasn't too bad. It's weird, I guess Fat Shark is sort of the reverse box in this game. He's hard to play, but not because he's super technical, but because he's so slow that he... You have to have knowledge of the technical yeah. stuff. That's right, once you learn all the technical stuff... Yeah. And on some of the stages, he's not even the fastest character. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. This is probably the one we should have started with. And that shark is ridiculous on this game. Because what turns? I, I, unfortunately, there we go. We're on horizontal now. Have not. Well, that's gonna be so much better. Oh yeah. Any of the A so tracks. A. This is playable. You press like right as the. I don't actually think in this case that it makes a difference. Oh, okay. Ooh, hello. And, uh, I think the record on this stage is done by snaking. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Because it's, it features so many straightaways. Oh, this is short. This is short. Yep. That short. Uh, oh, this 
this music. Let's go. This is so hype. It is. I'm not boosting very much. It's okay. You, you get yourself in the habit of it after playing for a while. Since it's not like Mario Kart or something. You actually go faster if you ram the wall at the end. Hey, that wasn't too bad. Yeah. There you go. I'm glad this game isn't like so hard, you know? <laughs> well, like, it looks like watching someone else play, it looks so intimidating. You know, because you move so fast. Yeah. Like, it's, I, it's not as intimidating playing it, I don't think. So if you played this game as a kid, I got bad news for you. And, uh, why is it not letting me exit this? Oh dear. Uh oh. Oh, you may have to be the one to test B. Uh oh. What? Why is it not letting me go back? Oh, no. Uh, well. There's a simple solution for that. You just reset. Aww. Ah, sorry. So in Grand Prix, yeah. if you played this as a kid, stage 7 is probably where you got stuck. I, I mean, I, I did it, but... Long story short, the, sh the story mode for this game is mm -hmm. insane. And I'm going to play, no, not Grand Prix, I'm sorry, story mode. Alright. So yeah, I've done this on, should be just normal, because that's how hard that one is. But I'm going to hand this one to you, my friend. This, first one? this is just stage one, and I've only ever beaten it on normal, for reference sake. I have How do you turn it to normal? Your whole left. There you go. So oh, oh, sorry. You get okay. Fat Shark by beating one of, I think it's stage four, on very hard. So I can do some of these on very hard, but the object is to get all the capsules. You're going to do three laps in 80 seconds. It's a okay. simple oval. But there are some capsules you have to do. Okay, so why is speed boost or whatever? Yeah, okay. I remember you don't have it on lap one. Oh, why? They they only unlock it out oh, on okay. lap one. Can I hold it down? Uh, oh no, you you have to press the boost. You can't hold this down. And if you miss one, don't worry. You can get it on the other lap. lap. Oh my goodness. We've got ourselves a speedrunner here. Oh man. Oh yeah. my gosh. Jeez. All but six on your first time. On your first lap, dude. You know, yeah, okay, you know what, what's preparing me for this? The lily pad level in sunshine. Okay, fair enough. Now here's where it gets scary. When you miss one on a given lap and you're like, oh god, I can't, I... I'm fine, there's one more. That one. There's one more. Yeah, you see it up there. Oh, which one? Where? Oh, okay. no, you're good now. Now we can boost. First try, man. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> okay, that's kind of hype. Actually, that is kind of hype. Alright. Oh my gosh, that face is so realistic. The cutscene, What man, in the world? They, they make this game. Douglas J. Falcon. Douglas J. Falcon. Have you seen, uh, what is that movie about going fast? It's an anime movie about racing. Red Line? I haven't, okay. no. That's what that reminds me of. Alright. This is the one where I put up my shift boosting episode on the channel. I'm not playing on very... I have beaten it on very hard. We're not doing that. You've got to watch the pet scene. I don't care if it gets my channel with a copyright claim. I don't care. This is beautiful. I'm getting some episode one vibes. You stole the prize money from us last time. You will pay for that. Why isn't he a Smash character? Because <laughs> he sucks at everything. Sort of a running joke in the series. I wish I could hear what he's saying. This is so weird. I have never seen this. What is his name against? Uh, Samurai Gora. Okay, that, okay. That's... Let's do it. 
Oh, that's so weird! Don't like that. Let's do it. Not show no For a hit! Yes. I can't lose my fire stingray. So this is the, um, the character so that gets strange. beaten every single time, no matter how hard he tries. Oh wait, which controller do I have? No, uh, we'll you, you switch him. Oh, it doesn't matter, yeah. probably, but... Okay, well now, now they're switched, so... All right. Alright, and Captain Falcon is also the Mario in this game, where all the stats are exactly in the middle. Okay. Yeah, and the music for this, if I could add this to the melee, I would. Now, for this one, yeah, since it's only one lap, you get it from the start. But this guy cheats, so, um... Oh boy. Hold on there. You may not want to use it all at the start. Oh, this... Oh, man. Wait, I wasn't even paying attention to, like, the meter or whatever. Alright, so, uh, you're not gonna have a wall over there. Okay, so it doesn't use too much. Not too much, no. And using a boost right at the start just to hit your max speed, that's fine. I think you end up getting... Assuming you don't hit anything, six or seven boots over the race. Oh. And this game is still only about 25 bucks on eBay or Amazon. Unless something is seriously oh changed my lately. Yes. Can I hit him? Yes. Oh no, what did I do? Oh, he just tapped him. And when you're going oh, 1200 awesome. kilometers an hour. Oh my gosh. Oh, you just tapped him. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, that's actually cool. This, this thing specifically reminds me of Lego Star Wars, the pod ring. Oh yes! Sorry. It does. You know, Episode 1 Pod Racer was also made by Sega. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. huh. It was on uh, N64 too, though, but the Dreamcast had the best known arcade oh version gosh. of it. Yeah, it was an arcade, too. You get, like, seven? You can catch up with this guy. I think you get seven. Because when you use three, you aren't quite at halfway. But if that's the case, your last one may not be a full boost. Oh my god. Hmm. Hey. Yeah, he's also dumb. They, I think they programmed him to hit the, bear, the boulders like that, just to show how dumb he is. How many do I have left? One and a half. Well, it'll start your boost, and then when you hit zero health, it'll stop you because you don't have to go. Oh, oh man! Oh, well, this mission is way harder. Yeah. Admittedly, I don't think I'd be by this point either. But oh, not. <laughs> I tried to do booster before I did. Uh, Oh yeah. my god! We're, we can I'm restart. winning! I'm gonna win! We can restart. Okay. I'm gonna win! Okay, you got this. So they do rubber band, so if you're way behind, he'll give you a bit of a chance. Oh, okay, that's... that's cool. Rubber band the opposite way. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have much left. This is the part where you pull out your mad CGM skills and start shift boosting. Well, I turn off. Let me, let me try it. Oh, no, I just died. How would you do that? Shift boosting? Yeah. The way I do it is I shift using the R button to go off oh. the stage, and then immediately turn and shift left. You don't have to turn to do it as well, oh, but it makes okay. it a lot easier. But if you turn, you can't chain them. You can't go so you like, just, shift off, on, off, on, off. That's what you're saying. Theoretically, that would be ideal, but that's also way harder to do. Oh, so you really you should turn. <laughs> if you're, you're only going to do a portal. Yeah. If your name isn't CGN, because that guy is a beast.
in my mind, Shiloh about this thing just to be written in the background here. Uh-huh. That's what helps me to get through very hard mode. And then he just flings himself forward ahead of you. Oh, oh dude, man. that was sick. I like how you get so much turn, like... Mm. Can you, like, knock him like, off or something? You can, but... You see how he's holding to the left side? They they do that intentionally. It's not just as following the apex of the turns. Oh! Wow, oh, same place. I think that's the same boulder. Yeah, dude. Alright. Well, I'm gonna try something. Speed run, career ruin. No. Can I, uh, can I see, uh, the... What, did, what is it? The ship list? Um, no. Oh, the wasabi? Yeah, yeah, wasabi. Alright, is this one very hard? Or, uh, this is still normal, guys. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's hard to do. It's hard to do. Yeah. It's not frame perfect, but it's not that far off. And this game is 60 FPS. Okay. Wow, I have a video of me doing it three times. So it's really hard. Rusty. Yeah, I'm rusty. So, but like, I've seen videos of people just doing it over and over, right? Oh my goodness. Like, just over and over and over yeah. and over? That's crazy. I think once I start getting the hang of it, it'll it yeah. might be a little bit slow. Yeah. That's cool, you can just, like, hold a direction, though. Ah. Alright, I swear. I'm gonna get this. Wow, that looks so hard. Uh, that looks really hard. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hate myself, but we're gonna, we're gonna get this eventually. Oh, you got it. Uh, so I got like, one. Did one. So you've got it three times. That's your. Well, in that case, it was three times, like for the whole video. I'll show you the video after this, but I'm doing it quite a bit more than that. There, there's one. Yeah, let's go. Uh, and so, without a boost, but those are all pretty sloppy. I mean, I've seen someone just ride the ledge. Like, yeah, I... Mm, couldn't get back on. That's crazy. That's so cool. <laughs> yeah. It looks so cool if you do it, right? Can I try some? Go for it, go for it. So I've, I've seen like... Oh my gosh. Okay, so you're, hold, you're holding A and pre- holding R and then pressing L. Is that what yes. it is? Okay. You can also simply turn and then hold, press L and turn to get yourself back on. Um, that's not ideal, but it's much wow, easier. Huh. It's just well, like, should you hold out R while you're doing it? Theoretically, that's the better way, that's well, the way you to should, chain that. For me, you should release R. Yes, okay. probably, yeah. But like, you're not going to be holding R while you're doing it. Okay. At best, you're going to do R just to get yourself off the clip. And then L to get back on. Okay. Like, think of it like a multi-shine. That's a terrible... <laughs> You're Peach and I'm Jigglypuff. That's maybe not the best example. Alright. Uh, I don't know. I don't really know if I wanted this time. Okay. Yeah. The speed runs for this game are also pretty pretty intense. Alright. That's so cool. Ah. Uh. Came at it at too sharp an angle. If you're doing it with the LR method, then you go parallel, but I am not, as you can see. Oh, that one missed. If you miss one, ooh! If you miss one, you actually lose speed. Really? If you never go off the ledge, but you turn and shift. Okay, here's my question. Yes. Do you think this was an intended technique or not? No, it was probably just a physics exploit, where if you go off the, if you don't have ground underneath you, you have no bound on your top speed, 
That's probably all. I mean, that sounds like a bug. Like, yeah. I haven't used the boost yet, so I should be okay. Oh, yeah, I'm over there. there. Uh, I've got more than that up here. I couldn't force him to use the boost there. Hey, hey. Maybe you should post this to YouTube. I mean, I'm doing it. All right. No. Oh, oh man. Yeah, I'm already out of boost. Wow, that's crazy. <sighs> yeah, once your health is there, then that gives us more melee, I guess. I gotta go. I'm gonna give it one more go. I got one too close. Bugs. I could do some uh, sunshine. Yeah, so like uh. One thing I do is just run around the plaza and go feed a plaza with the turbo nozzle. Oh, okay. That's pretty fun. That was the part. Um. Yeah, but. Uh. Oh, okay. What? Oh, I lost speed there. Oh, really? Point. There? Yeah, even though I went off, I lost speed. Um. All right. No, no, it's last one. I just <laughs> last, last one. one. Man, when I say last one on something, there's at least forty or fifty yeah. more. <laughs> yeah, but now I'm normally for me. Uh, for me too, but I'm holding somebody up. So okay. All right. Can you show off some sunshine yeah. shenanigans for us now, and then we'll go to some melee, I guess. Yeah, I mean, I won't do it very long. And also, it's only if you have a save file. I guess you know. I should. Okay. Yeah, so we don't have to go through the intro pet yeah. scene. And, well, no, yeah. so, I mean, unlock the turbo. And also, oh, okay. yeah. yeah, yeah, that's fair. Now, we're just going to have a, a casual speed run of it. Now, when yeah. you say three hours, that was 100% or any No, that was or? just any percent. So, okay. I had never done it before. So, like... I lost a lot of time in some places, mm. like a lot of time. Like, I lost at least ten minutes to the Chuckster stage. Oh, I mean, the one like, where they have to bare minimum. Uh, it was also late at night, so I, I would okay. when I was going through that, I was just like, <laughs> I was just like dead in my dead in my soul. Mm. Oh man! Oh. Yeah. Wait! 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 Well, no, 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 because. No, no. Are you kidding? No, 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 it's still new, so... There isn't, there isn't a, uh, there isn't a game. Yeah. It's fine. I could have sworn. Oh, well. Uh, we actually have more memory cards down here at the room, so... Do you have a brother? I do, yeah. He used to play Sheik, but I think that there's now enough of a gap between us that he doesn't like, play anymore. Yeah. So that's how it goes for my brother sometimes. Oh. Rip. Nice though. Alright, well. Yeah, okay. okay. So that's a thing. I'm sorry. Oh no, it's no problem. Hello? Oh, okay. Hmm. It's weird. Yeah. It's so weird. Alright, get some melee. Melee. Oh, oh, one thing we could do. How'd you get? Uh, oh, that too. Well, one thing is we could do is we could see that match uh, that I, I like, tagged you in. Oh, okay. Is okay. That, we is can that do that. 